Hello. Daddy, can you bring me a Harry Potter t-shirt from London? Of course, my love, I will. You know that you're my favorite daughter. I'm your only daughter! I'm spending a few days in London, UK, and I have a few goals for this trip. The main one is to record a video about how I record myself while traveling. And I also want to get a few things to bring back home to my girls. What you see behind me is Canary Wharf. That's where the money is made. Let me see if I can find some music that sounds like Succession. More or less. That's the best I could do with epidemic sounds. The sun is gone. Party's over. Baker Street is one of the most iconic underground stations in London. An officer just kindly asked me not to use my tripod. When I arrived a couple of days back, I saw a wedding photographer picking this spot for portraits, and they normally know the best spots in town. Look left, look right, don't get yourself killed. Hey love, how's London? Do you miss me? Terribly. Liar. Can you bring some food as souvenir, please? Of course, babe. Where can I get some typical British food? Marks and Spencer. I've got you. Cheers. Armite. This extract. Love it or hate it, they say. Scones, of course. It can't get more British than this. We're going to play a bit at the hotel bathroom. Camera over there, monitoring up, and a ring light. I forgot to pack my deodorant and I ran out of perfume. So here I am, in the cradle of civilization, smelling like a caveman. I never liked the catch lights of ring lights when I saw them on magazines. But I'm starting to appreciate that it's a flattering setup. Ah, uh, yeah. Let's not forget our Harry Potter fan. What a nightmare for sure, but mission accomplished. If you are curious about the gear I used, it's all on my travel filmmaking gear video over here, except for the wireless microphone that you can find here. Thanks for watching and see you on my next video.